Hey guys, this is P from Static Tech, and in this video, I will be doing a 4.2.1 untethered jailbreak uh, tutorial. And um, the devices this works for is the well, basically all devices running iOS 4.2.1 or 4.2. They're basically the same thing. If there's any confusion there, um, it works for all of them except the iPhone 3G. I'm not sure why that one's not included, but they didn't include it, I guess. So it'll work for all other devices. Um, I'll be using my, let's get that on screen, focus, okay, the, my iPhone, my iPod Touch, and as you can see it's running 4.2.1 firmware, and, um, the first thing you want to do is go to greenpoison.com, as you can see I'm on their homepage right now, I'll give you the link in the description, but if you, um, uh, well, here's the link, uh, the address, it's G-R-E-E, N P O I S the number zero N dot com and it'll take you to the screen and the first uh thing you're gonna do to start the jailbreak is download either Mac, Linux or Windows, depending on which operating system you're running. I'm running Windows. So as you can see, it downloads very, very quickly. I can just open it up right away. And I'm using WinRAR. Um, you're gonna need something to extract it. I use WinRAR. It's you know pretty good and free, so you can download that. It's free download. And um, Green Poison comes up, so we're gonna open that up. Okay, so it's prepared to jailbreak right now. And I'm gonna put my iPod Touch. Oh, just a second. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna put it on screen, and all I'm doing right now is hitting Prepare to Jailbreak. Get ready to start. Okay, press and hold the sleep button. Continuing holding sleep, press and hold home. As you can see, my computer made some noises. Release sleep button, continue holding home. Uh, don't worry if your computer make no makes noises, that's normal. It's, um, okay, as you can see, ready to jailbreak. And there is the jailbreak button right there. I'm just going to hit that. Right now it's jailbreaking. I'll show you my device. There. There goes the green bar. As you can see, my screen flashed white, which is a good thing. And here comes the codes on screen. This should be happening. This is happening. Don't worry. It's normal. As it's still jailbreaking. I'm showing you this in real time just so you guys know exactly um, what you have to do. As you can see on screen it says jailbreak complete. It's not 100% complete. It's just the application. You can close that. As you can see more codes are running. You can close the application but you're going to want to leave your iPod on and not like do anything with it. Just leave it like this. And um, as you can see it's still running some codes. And the next thing that should happen after this is um, the Green Poison logo will come up. Like, you know, when you start up your iPod, the Green Poison logo will come up instead of the Apple logo. And then it'll, like, change the Apple logo or something. Like, it'll change from Apple to Green Poison, then Green Poison to Apple. And then it will, uh, your iPod will um, reboot, and you can go into Loader and download Cydia, which I won't be sh uh, showing that step. Well, actually, I might, I might show that step. We're going to see later in the video. Um, if I decide to include that, but um, like I said, that's what you're gonna have to do. And then uh, once installed Cydia, your device is basically jailbroken. Other than that, um, while we're at, okay, let's actually let's see this happening. Okay, so right there, the Apple logo changed to the Green Poison logo. Put this a little closer to the screen. Now it's rebooting. I'm guessing. I use this on my iPod Touch fourth gen worked pretty good um, only took one try as here it's like flashing between the green poison and the apple logo same stuff I don't know this is pretty cool how they got this I don't know if it's every time you restart it or whatever I'm sorry guys I was a little late to this jailbreak I know there's hey, here it goes it's rebooting but like I was saying I'm a little late to this jailbreak I want to put all my jailbreaks like the first day it comes out and I'm actually seven days late on this one because I just didn't think it was coming out anytime soon. People have been waiting for the jailbreak forever. 
I mean, like, they said they're going to release it during Christmas, and now it's February. So it's been a long time. And that was, they said they're going to release it on Christmas, and that was already a late date. And then they um, just kept on postponing it. They, I think they wanted the Verizon iPhone to come out first. And it did. Like I said, this does work with the Verizon iPhone. And there we go. Looks like it should be jailbroken. I'm just going to slide to unlock. And we're going to see if we have loader. Yes, we do. Right there. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's that icon right there. It's green. And we're going to open it up. I think I will show you guys how to download Cydia. Unless it fails on me. Because sometimes it fails the first time. And there you go. You got to install Cydia. We're going to do that. Uh, okay, this one doesn't look like it's failing. So, it's going. It's pretty quick. And look at that. It's already to extracting. Success. Now we're just going to click the home button. And where's the... Oh, wait. It's respringing the board. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay. Um... I'm just going to wait for this to start up, and Cydia should be there. Now, what I want to know from you guys is, uh, wow, does that happen every time you reboot it? Because that's pretty, that's pretty sweet. But, um, like I was saying, I have any, do you guys have any suggestions for, um, what I should do on my next jailbreaks? I know that's going to be a while away, but, uh, do you like it like this when I'm off screen and showing you the actual iPod? Or do you like it when I'm using Camtasia Studio and just capturing the screen like I did in my other video? I mean, in this, you can actually see the iPod, whereas in the other one, you can actually see the screen better because I'm able to zoom in on the screen and things like that. As you can see, I think we should have Cydia, and yes, we do. So, that's basically the jailbreak, but like I was saying, tell me, do you guys want this um, off-screen or do you want it on-screen? Any suggestions for my jailbreak videos? Whatever you may have, I, I need suggestions because I want to make the best videos for you guys. And that's basically it. And remember to rate, subscribe, and um, comment. Bye, guys.